YT Dan Duel Links is brought to you by dank duelists like you. Become a YouTube member to never miss. What's going on my boy YT Dan back at it again with another video. Now this is going to be a very quick video because um, I have to get in here really quick as you can possibly see right here. But uh, my boys this deck is absolute fire in the Casey Cup right now. I'm going to tell you why really quickly. Um, most people are playing that Kamakuri deck and because they're uh, playing the Kamakuri deck um, it's easily countered with this trap card called Bad Aim. When they activate the uh, level 5 monsters effect to target the level 2 monster so that they can begin their synchro combos, Bad Aim gets that monster off the field and ends their combo cold. Which leaves them wide open for the summoning of Angel Trumpeter to bring out your Archfiend's uh, call and then go ahead and make sure they feel the call of the Archfiend by using Battle Tuned for a one turn OTK 4400 direct smack to the face using Angel Trumpeter. So the real power to this deck is that we run a Summon Skull, a random vanilla Summon Skull in this deck. Um, so many times I've come across opponents where I literally was like Summon Skull for game and it's absolutely disgusting. So if you didn't know what Archfiend's call is destroyed, this car can uh, grab a summon skull from anywhere and special summon it. And basically, um, when your opponent goes out of their way to kill summon skull, this Archfiend's called summon skull, they're typically gonna be able to overpower it maybe one time and they'll have some jank monsters on the field. But you've probably dealt so much damage using battle tuned and other stuff that, you know, that summon skull is gonna be just enough to run over that next monster for game which you'll see in a replay. Um, I can't, honestly, I'm not gonna be able to continue the KC Cup. <laughs> I literally was trying to play and, you know, <laughs> it wasn't working out my voice. But listen, right now this deck is nine and one. Um, I only lost one duel and I don't even remember what that uh, opponent was. It probably was just some random guy, but against Invoked, against Shirnui, against uh, Karakiri against Cyber Dragon against everything in the meta. This deck is absolutely clapping. And I would say, you know, I did say it was free to play my boy, but so you want to make sure instead of wall of D or maybe this, you can put in any removal you want in the slot of, uh, forbidden Lance, and you can use wall of D in the slot of drowning mirror force. The rest of this is all SRs and URs. And then also, I wanna put a special highlight on this card called Photon Cerberus. Now, a lot of you guys don't know about this card, but Photon Cerberus is a very good card that basically says, when this card is normal summon, it shuts down traps for the whole turn. This card is a is a, is a normal summon Jinzo, and I don't see why people have not been using it. They just don't know that this card exists. But in this deck, I decided to switch it out for uh, the Phantom Bird because being able to destroy back row is a lot more useful, um, especially when you don't have Angel Trumpeter or you have the Archfiend's Call set up. And then also shout out to my boy Barky Lion for coming out and clapping every Cyber Dragon deck he's ever seen. He can negate all their traps and then also we're boosting to the max. Also this deck has a swift OTK. If your opponent puts a bunch of bullshit on the board and they don't have a good back row, Brionic, put all that shit back. Battle tune for game. All right, man, that's all I got to say. I hope you guys enjoy this uh, video. I'm back, going back to, you know, more YT parenting. Enjoy the rest of the clips. Good luck in the KC Cup. I won't see you there. Uh... <laughs> all right, my boys, I appreciate y'all for watching. And as always, keep it dank.